Hello everybody, Feel the Music 58 here, and uh, I wanted to show y'all the self-watering um, rain gutter garden. Now this idea came from Larry Hall up in Brainerd, Minnesota, so I want to give him a big shout out. Now, the cages and what have you, I got to tell y'all, I had to put them on there on account of squirrels. Them dang squirrels, they eat up everything, so... Let me take this off here, or you can see what we got. All right. Now, on this end here, this is some young kale and some Swiss chard. And then uh, some stuff that we've been planting here in the self-watering rain gutter garden. Here we have dinosaur kale, lacinto or something like that. I don't know. We call it dinosaur kale. And that's there is um, purple tops. Now here is my lettuce, and uh, it looks like it's trying to bolt on me. It is December the 31st here on the Gulf Coast, so go figure. And uh, spinach down there, it ain't doing too good. But here's the uh, rain gutter. <clears throat> here you can see the float, and it's hooked up to a. A hose that goes over to a rain barrel. All this water here is rain water. Uh, we had a drought here in the deep south that went 42 days. I mean, it was unheard of. 42 days without any kind of rain. The whole time, this garden here, it was a little dry on the very top. But if you stuck your finger in there and scratched around a bit, maybe two inches deep, well, not even that deep, maybe an inch and a half, you would find moisture. So this system works. If you want to know how to do it, then I would recommend that you check with Larry, Larry Hall. Uh, he's got some real good videos. Rather than me tell you how to do it, uh, best thing to do is just check with him. And uh, he can tell you exactly how all this. Look, at, look on his YouTube channel. He's got a, uh, some real good stuff. Anyway, this is the self-watering rain gutter garden. And as you can see, it does good. Now, one of the things that I like about it is I'm pushing 60 years old. And I can sit down on a bucket or maybe a milk crate and harvest. You know, like this Swiss chard right here. I can harvest that stuff sitting down. And uh, I like it very much. So, anyway, that's the self-watering rain gutter garden. And, uh... Y'all check it out, and we'll see you later.